up for Simon Evans. Good evening, good evening. Very nice to be here. I thought I might start this evening with a joke. <laughs> Concerns three men, uh, an Englishman, a Welshman, and a Pakistani. <laughs> yes, weren't expecting that, were you? <laughs> That's my favorite bit of the joke, to be honest. The tension, which is suddenly palpable in the room when I mention the third member <laughs> of that little gathering. I will mentioned the chap who told me this joke. I didn't know him terribly well. He had already uttered the immortal phrase, some of my best friends are black, which is rarely a sign of an untroubled conscience. <laughs> and I did have to point out to him that Labradors don't count. But as it happened, <laughs> as it happened, I think he was in the clear on this one. Anyway, you be the judge. Three men, English, Welsh, Pakistani, these three congregate one morning, innocently enough, in the maternity ward of their local hospital to collect their newborn sons. Uh, the mood is one of joyous anticipation, from which we may reasonably deduce that they are first-time fathers. <laughs> but a note of bitterness there for serial parents. However, this mood, fragile as it is, is shattered prematurely when they are informed by the doctor in charge, or more likely some sort of middle management lackey who is siphoning funds away from frontline services, but <laughs> do that as it may, they are informed that there has been a bit of a mix-up at the hospital and he can no longer say with any certainty whose son is whose. <laughs> now, you or I in this situation, I imagine, would probably return home and inform our legal representatives and begin a costly and time-consuming but ultimately profitable suit against this hospital for gross professional misconduct. At the very least, you would demand a DNA test be conducted in order to establish paternity. But this being a joke... <laughs> The three men agree to sort it out between them. The Englishman goes in first, as is his right. <laughs> According to strict alphabetical order, at the very least, let us say. The Englishman goes in first and emerges a moment later with what is quite clearly, even to the medically untrained eye, the Pakistani child. Pakistani gentleman says as much, and the Englishman says, well, I'm sorry, mate, but one of those two in there is Welsh, and I'm not taking any chances. 